Hi, my name is Kurt Parker. I'm with Microchip in their 32-bit microcontroller division, and I want to show you today our MPLAB Harmony Graphics Suite demos. One of the great things about MPLAB Harmony Graphics Suite is that it supports a wide range of performance uh, microcontrollers and microprocessors from Microchip. We support everything from Cortex M0 Plus designs, as you see here from uh, this signage display, this enables us to be able to change demos on any of the other panels without having to redo the panel completely. We just reprogram the name of the demo directly into this design. We go up to the Cortex M4, and that's this one right here. This is based on the SAM E54. Now, this gives you a nice uh, midpoint in terms of power and performance and price with excellent touch response on our graphic demo. The same library is being used for both of these demos as well as for all of the others that you see on this platform. The next step up would be a Cortex M7. This one is our SAM E70 running at 300 megahertz. This one is running a direct drive through the parallel port to this WQVGA display. And the following one after that is the PIC32 MZDA. Now this is a full microcontroller with two megabytes of flash, 640K uh, of SRAM, but it also has an internal graphics controller capable of supporting two layers plus background layer, an internal graphics processor, which processes uh, blit as well as shapes and deletes, and internal DDR2 DRAM up to 32 megabytes for all of the frame buffers for each of those layers. Now, again, as I said before, we're using the same tools in the MPLAB Harmony Graphics Suite and the same libraries throughout each of these platforms. But what's even better is that we extend into the microprocessor space. This is an uh, AT-SAM A5D2 microprocessor, and it is running MPLAB Harmony Graphics Suite libraries, and we programmed it with MPLAB X and MPLAB um, uh, MP Lab tools and we are running a dashboard application on this. So now you have the same tools and the same library through from Cortex M0 all the way to the Cortex A5 performance base. This gives you a lot of flexibility to be able to support multiple different performance and price points in your application when you need graphics. For more information, check out www.microchip.com graphics. Thank you.